Hello, everybody. Oh, let's get the mouse out of here. Y'all don't want to see that crap. <coughs> anyway, yeah, so here we are, back in the Earthbound. This is Dusty Dunes Desert. We only have 60 bucks, and so we're going to need to withdraw some money so we can get some new equips in this video. $14,000. Let me take out 2000 I don't know if that'll be enough, but we'll see. Talk to this guy. We're going to purchase some new things. We're going to want... Oh, it's not going to be enough. Coin of Slumber. Why is it only saying that Ness needs that? Let's see what my other characters have equipped. Coin of Slumber. Mr. Saturn coin. Okay, I guess we'll just buy that one Coin of Slumber then. Because that's Ness is the only one who needs it. Alright, which of you will, will carry this burden? And I would give it to Ness, but he's full of crap. Oh, come on, guys. Let's see. What is he carrying he doesn't need? Let's give the PSI Caramel to Paula, because she's the one... Well, she can't carry it either, but it's already... She's carrying too much stuff, man. Maybe we should use some of this stuff or sell it. I don't know how our health is right now, but I'm gonna eat a croissant. Om nom 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 nom. Actually, he did recover a little bit of health from that, so that helps. She doesn't need that ribbon anymore, does she? Wow, look at all the stuff we got here. The teddy bear... I didn't realize the teddy bear took up an item slot even when it was following you. Jeez. Okay, well, let's get back to business here. I want to buy that coin of slumber for Ness. You see, it's not like he really needs an extra slot to carry it either, because it's going to go in the same slot. Hang on, I'm turning my volume down. There we go. Ooh, it's too loud. I think I slid my arm across the little dial and spun it up to get myself more... Uh... Alright, Mr. Baseball Bat. We're also going to get the deluxe frying pan. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and just get the bat now. That, of course, is Ness's uh, new weapon from 92, from 80 up to 92. We'll sell that back. And I think we're going to need to get more money out before we can uh, purchase the rest of this uh, stuff here. I don't think that there's anything new we need to grab for Trev in this particular stop-off. But I know that we need to get the deluxe frying pan for Paula. But look, come on, it isn't like she needs an extra slot because it's going to be replaced with whatever it is that she gets next. You know what, let's just sell some things. Let's just, uh... These menus aren't the most intuitive for me yet. Sell the ribbon. Yes. Uh, can I get you anything else? Yes. We want to sell some more stuff. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Good little music in here. Let's see. Mm, excuse me. Um, well, you know what? I suppose... Yes. Okay, now we're going to buy that thing for Paula because she has room for it. And Paula will carry it. Okay, we'll equip it here. Offense goes up to 66. We'll sell that back. Okay. And I think that's all we need to do for right now because in terms of our equips... We all have great charms. We all have silver bracelets. We either have a coin of slumber or a Mr. Saturn coin, which actually puts his defense uh, at the highest of all of us. That's Trev who has a Mr. Saturn coin. Laser gun, deluxe fry pan, and Mr. Baseball bat. So things look okay. Let's go ahead and put back the rest of that money, because I don't need to be carrying that around right now. Uh, if I die... Wow, we had exactly 2,000 left. How cool is that? Actually, shoot, I didn't want to put all of it back in. <laughs> We're going to need, like... It's good to carry around maybe like a hundred bucks with you just because you might need to buy something, something small. Or health restorative item, you might need to give somebody something, whatever. So you see how we're sweating right now? That means that the area that we're walking through... Sneak attack? Sneak attack? Sneak attack? Yeah. I still don't know why I'm not getting a swirl. I think that's a glitch in the emulator, so I'm sorry. Hello. Shh, don't talk too loud. What do you want? Look how much you need. Yeah, it's a zip gun. Not as good as what we currently have. But we got bottle rockets and bombs and stuff like that. Keep on the watch for bad guys. Alright, we'll do. This looks like a dead end, is it? Yep. <laughs> cool. Once you, load, once you load the sprites of those cards, I'm telling you, you get some slowdown. Mm hmm. Well, hello, free experience. I'd like you. Those are just mole playing roughs right there. Uh, yeah, so it's not a whole lot. 150 experience each. Oh, there's a monkey out here. Hello. Coo -coo -coo -coo. Welcome. Our paradise exists between is an ex <laughs> exists beneath that hole. Talarama is great and kind. He knows everything. He made us the underground rooms. 
We don't want to go down there yet. We're going to have to come back to that later in the LP, actually. Hello, butterfly. Come here. Nope. Okay. Now, there's an enemy out here called the Criminal Caterpillar that I know we want to try to eventually run into. I'm going to set it straight over to the side right now because I believe that there's a speck out here. Hello. What are you? There's a buffalo coming in. This is a desert wolf. These guys can actually be pretty nasty. We're going to use freeze uh, beta on them. And our other two party members will just attack. Because these guys can do some pretty nasty damage. Oh, shoot. There was something else I was supposed to pick up while we were here. And that was uh, refreshing herbs from that drugstore. Because if we get poisoned, things can go very bad very quickly. I'm going to get behind him if I can. I'm not sure if that was a sneak attack or not, but it should have been. Yes, it was the attack. Nice. Okay, great. Um, what we want to do is paralyze this buffalo. 24. Wow, I don't think if I need. I don't know if I need to use that. Let's just use the, uh, the alpha. Hopefully that'll work. But okay, I'm not gonna use thunder because there's only one enemy. But uh, we'll shoot him. But I know that these guys can take out your party members in one shot if you get an un if you're unlucky. Did it work? Yeah, there we go. Great. And so we gotta be really careful when we're fighting them, because if he can knock Ness out in one shot, that's uh, not good. Yeah, there we go. That worked very nicely. I don't think we would even have needed the paralysis. I should have just bashed him. But somewhere out here, there's either a white or black sesame seed down here. I believe it's, I need to give that bottle rocket to... Ooh, whoa, Trev actually has a, a sunburn. We need to fix that. So let's give Trev the bottle rocket, because he's the one who's going to use that. And then Ness is going to use his healing alpha on Trev. And it should cure the sunstroke. Excuse me, not sunburn. Which is a lot worse than sunburn, actually. What is this? Hello. This hole's, gr <laughs> this hole's great! That's what he said. Good hole, good hole, good hole. First, someone asked me to dig for buried gold. I began to feel like I was obligated to find it. Man, am I starving. You have any food for me? Yeah, sure. What are you going to give me? Hmm... Should we be an, an ass and give him the calorie stick? Just some really cruddy, boring food? No, let's give him something that's not all that valuable to us. I um, guess we can give him the hamburger. I don't even know. And cool, if I find the gold, I'll give it to you. That's nice of him. Jeez. I wouldn't be that generous. Oh, there's a telephone in here? Are you going to help us? Please stay tonight. Oh. Well, thank you very much. Awesome. I love it. Free restoration. Can't say no, man. Alright, where's that sesame seed? I think he's by the sign, if I remember correctly. It's either a small black or a small white speck on the screen. I want to go after that enemy right there, so I think I'm going to take on both of these guys. Why not? I think I might try out PSI Thunder, because the thunder is accuracy increases as time goes by. Er, not as time goes by, what am I even saying? As the number of enemies increases, it's more likely to hit. So let's try Thunder Beta. Oh, it doesn't cost a whole lot. And it also hits more times. So let's see if we can hit them since there's two targets. Yeah, 133! And it strikes twice. Very nice. Good stuff. Yeah, I had a commenter that uh, told me that I was wasting a really good move by not using Thunder. I quite frankly didn't understand how it worked because. I thought that it was just a cruddy spell and it missed a whole lot. But I don't know. I, apparently, its chance to hit increases as the number of enemies increases, but you can't determine who it's going to strike at any time, given moment, so you gotta be careful. That crested buka right there, I don't really know what we're supposed to do about that, <laughs> so I'm just gonna keep bashing it. That's pretty much the default attack for any just generic enemy that you don't know what to do with. You just bash it until it's gone. So I've shown the wolf, I've shown the the buffalo, and I've shown the crested bukas. Now I think I might start cutting out battles because we've seen the enemies from this area. I think there's another one, like I said, the criminal cat. Oh, look, there's just nothing but sand here. You know that you have a sunstroke if your screen starts flashing red. I have crap on my screen that looks that looks like. Oh, well, two of them got it all at once there. I think you only take damage if you move around. But healing alpha is enough to fix it, so... It's not that bad. Whoop, I'm getting a call. 
Hello, it's your dad. No, 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 no. Dad, I'm telling you, I'm trying to save the world. You can't be calling me all the time like this. It's just not gonna fly. Alright, there you go. There's also an item called the wet towel that you can use to fix that sunstroke problem. I'm just stopping occasionally to check and see if I have one. Yeah, I am <laughs> not so good at this. I don't know where the sun... Oh, oh, there's an item out here. Hello. The sudden guts pill. Cool, there's a butterfly down there. I'd love to get to him without <laughs> running into an enemy. Oh, you're gonna hide behind the buffalo? Thanks a lot. And the wolf! Oh. That wasn't so bad. Give me that butterfly. But, uh, yeah, I tried out Thunder again, and I've seen that it actually can hit, uh, different enemies on the same turn. I used Thunder Beta, which strikes twice, and it's actually able to strike on two separate enemies, depending on how it goes. Come back here, you little butterfly! Get over here! Haha, <laughs> got him. I feel like I don't know the Sunstroke, just chasing after him, but it's worth it. Yeah, you'll be healing these sunstrokes near constantly out here in the desert. So I'm gonna meet you guys, I think, when I find that first sesame seed. Oop, new enemy. Never mind. I like how even the teddy bear is sweating. That's neat. So the smiling sphere. This guy is going to explode when we kill him, I believe. So once we take him out... Oh wow, he's doing fire. Is that gonna hit all of us? Well, that's not cool. That's a lot of damage. Oh my goodness. All of us and the teddy bear? Oh, that's a slap in the face! Oh, man. Uh, hmm. Freeze him, I suppose. Man, that's not cool. Ten damage! Oh, well, freeze was the wrong spell to use. Exploded into bits. Exit the battle quickly. No pause and a die! Oh, are you serious? Oh, come on. Oh. Jeez. Man, there goes our primary attacker. Ooh, man. There's a buffalo right on our... right on top of us. Crap, get out of there. Oh, that's no good. Paul is dead. That's gonna make this a bit tougher. Oh, come on, where's that sesame seed, man? It's gotta be right here. Oh, there's a, there's a present. The PSI caramel inside. Alert! Perhaps condition is critical. He'll collapse if his condition isn't treated. Well, jeez, we better use... Healing on him. Well, he needs life up too, honestly. So we'll heal him. We'll use some life up for him. There we go. 100 HP, that's about what Alpha will ever restore. I was gonna meet you guys until I found. Watch out! Oh, what the? What are those little things in front of us? A scalpion! I guess it's like a scorpion? Hmm. Alright, well. Best we can do is bash on them. I know these guys are capable of poisoning you, which could be very bad if that happens. So we better whoa the teddy bear. Okay, good. As long as it wasn't us. Oh, these guys don't seem that bad. Oh, they don't have a whole lot of health, do they? Okay. I guess the ability to poison makes up for their low health. If you get poisoned out in this desert, you could be in trouble. Dude, those spheres are really fast. Oh, dude, back attacked by a buka. And there's a sphere getting in on it. Oh man, how do you want to go about this? Oh, they get to attack first too, even the, the Sphere even got to go first, because even though he wasn't part of it. Oh, should, I, should I just recover? I think so. I don't want to end up getting killed. I need to start taking that Sphere out, because he can do quite a bit of damage. Don't go after Ness. Oh, wow, he just barely didn't kill Ness. Five, five HP left. Yeah, we're gonna have to just wait this out. Um, cause I'm gonna have Ness use gaming beta. I do not want this fight to go badly. I'm just gonna have him shoot, but I'm gonna wait until my HP fills up before I shoot, because if he explodes, I don't want him to kill Ness or uh, Trev. So uh, I think that's enough. Ness gets to go first. That's good. His HP gets to continue scrolling up. I'm gonna get out of here. Oh come on, moral damage to Ness. Come on, kill that Buka. We gotta get out of here. Goodness. Whew. That's dangerous. Oh my goodness. We're just getting our butts kicked out here in this desert. Oh my goodness. And the butterfly? Or the... Uh, the teddy bear? Dude. Really. Oh, Trev got poisoned. Oh boy. We're gonna die. This is not good. 
15 damage. I don't even know if I can fix that. I'm not sure if healing beta will, will take care of poison or not. I would think not, because of the way that the guide offered, or told you to get refreshing herbs, but... We need to do something about this. Let's see if healing will fix it. Oh, thank goodness. There's a butterfly down there. Come here, butterfly. Get over here! Uh, really? Where are you taking us? Jeez. Well, it's not much use for Trev, is it? Man, I can't believe we let Paula die. I'm gonna go ahead and just use a couple of life noodles, because... I don't want her to remain dead. She's... she's important. <laughs> Alright, anybody else need help? Nope. Alright, no, 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 don't run away from him like you keep doing. My first response is to run off, and all it means is I get a back attack. I tell you, these enemies out here are not friendly. You gotta be careful. Let's see, what don't talk to? I wanna use PSI, not on me. Oh, oh well, I guess that works. I needed it anyway. Now on pro. There we go. No, 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 avoid the wolf. Avoid the buka. Avoid everything! Ugh! No way, that wasn't a back attack, I was running to the right! Well, don't use fire on the bukas. That's only seven damage, wow. That was a waste of a turn. Inside the present, there was a picnic lunch. Neat. And Paula's level one up. Nice. Jeez. Trev gets poisoned again. Mm -mm -mm. I'm not sure if healing Alpha would fix it or not, but... I'm not gonna take the chance. Go ahead and heal him again. Man. The enemies out here are not forgiving. Okay, so there's an oasis. One of those dudes. One of the little flecks of... Sesame is around here. I remember them being in. Whoop! Somebody's got a sunstroke. Jeez. This is gonna run out of uh, PSI soon. Hello, little monkey. That sea monkey's living the sea. Desert monkey's living the desert. I mean, desert, not dessert. I'm happy that there are animals in the desert, aren't you? I guess so. Be a lot more lonely out here if there weren't. Hey, the hair is a butterfly down there. Butterfly, 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 butterfly. Oh, dude! Butterflies running away. Because the desert's so open, there's something for them to run into, get caught on. Enemies behind us, ugh. Dude. Yeah, you're gonna run into these cute little UFOs sometimes. I'll go ahead and show this. I don't know if we've had, had these guys yet. I know we've had UFOs, but I don't know if we've had the cute little UFO. Man, this is getting really old. Whew. We'll go with Thunder. Yeah, I'm gonna shoot the UFO too. I think that in the next video, I might just cut to all the places that you need to go in this desert. Because I've effectively been running around for 20 minutes and uh, haven't accomplished much because uh, I don't really know where anything is. I'm just kind of running around. I just figured I'd do this if I see my fans, but it's not really working. So, in the next episode, I'm going to cut around in the desert and show you exactly where everything is, and then we're going to get out of here because I don't want to waste three videos in this place. A bag of fries. And that's as the level goes up. Nice. I guess we're getting a bit of grinding. I'm HP up by 24, PP up by 5. You know it. So, oh, Sunstroke, are you serious, man? On Paula, please. Alright. So the next episode of Get Away From That Sphere, man. The Buka. I'll do the Buka! No, not the... Oh. <sighs> As I was saying, the next episode... There's a Caterpillar! Oh, I'm getting him. No, avoid the Buka, avoid the Buka, avoid the Buka! Oh, dude, I want that Caterpillar, man! Crap, Paula's poisoned. I need to be able to run. Ugh. Wait a minute. No, no, use... No, no, no. Healing beta on Paula. Thank you. Get that caterpillar! No, no! Yes! Wait, what? I said it was a back attack. No, there's a scalpion right there! What the heck? Where did he come from? I'm more poisoned. Ah, oh, just get rid of him. I want to get that caterpillar, man. The caterpillar is going to give us a lot of experience, and I want to catch him because they're pretty rare. Yes, experience. I know. Great. Caterpillar's right there. No, don't run through him. Get him. Get him! Back attack. And insta-kill. Do 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 do! That's and his friend. Gave 10,000 experience each. Paula gets a level up. And... That's it! What?! <laughs> Poisoned. 700 to the next level. 12,000 to the next level. 6,000 to the next level. Oh, well, 10,000 experience is still nice. Oh, poisoned. Man. 
I gotta get out of this desert, man. In the next video, we're gonna take five minutes, finish up the desert, and then get the heck out of here. I'll see you guys then. Oh, there's a monkey. I'm back where I started! Oh, See you guys later.